Hello, good morning. Welcome to our recorded class. This is the pre-kinder level and today it's January 26, 2022. It is a Wednesday and we always say good morning. Good morning to you, Julius and Eliana. And we have our first part of the class for today, the review. And what do we have here for the review? Let's do our words or pictures here that begin with the letter O. The ones with O sound for O. O, O, letter O. And how about we put the fruits that begin with O, let's put them here in our O tree. Orange, O. O, orange for letter O. Yes, let's put orange in O. It begins with O. How about pizza? Pizza. No, pizza doesn't go in O. It's for P. How about monkey? Monkey. It's for letter M. Monkey, not O. How about queen? Do we put queen in O? No, queen doesn't go in O. It has qu sound Q. Next, we have the needle. Do we put it in O? Needle. No, it's for letter N. How about octopus? Octopus, yes, octopus goes in O. How about nail? Nail. Do we put nail in letter O? No, it's for letter N, not O. How about owl? Owl, yes, O for the owl. Now, how about we spell out our fruits here? The ones that go in our O tree. So we have orange, O-R-A-N-G-E. That's the word orange. Next, we also have the octopus, O-C-T-O-P-U-S. That's the octopus. And the last one, we have the owl, O-W-L, owl. And how about we check again? O is for the orange, octopus and owl, and they all have letter O. Now let's move on to our sight words. And remember, we have a set of words for this week. The first one is the word funny. F, U, N, N, and Y. That makes the word funny. When you find something funny, it makes you laugh. Maybe something silly makes you laugh. Maybe the clown is funny for you. So how about our sentence here? We have the word funny, F U N N and Y funny. I see the ostriches do a funny dance. I see the ostriches do a funny dance. What else do we have here for our word funny? We have the word funny, F U. N, N, and Y, funny. The orange has a funny face. The orange has a funny face. We have our funny face for the orange. What else do we have here for the word funny? We have F, U, N, N, Y. This is the word funny. The small octopus looks funny. The small octopus looks funny. How about for another word and it is the word get. When you need something, you need to get it. G, E, and letter T. G, E, and letter T. That's the word get. Get. And how about for our sentence for the word get. G, E, and T, get. I will get some olive oil. I will get some olive oil. And then how about for another sentence for get? G-E-N-T. The chef will get his bowl of oatmeal. The chef will get his bowl of oatmeal. We have the word get. G-E-T. Get. Next one. We also have the word get again. G E N T. Get. I need to get some onions. I need to get some onions. And we have the word get. G E T. Get. Now we're done already with the sight words. It's time already to do another part of our class and that is to do our lesson. And we have here words that has the O sound in the beginning. So we have the first word, 
Owen and that's on. I will switch on the lights. Next, we have the word off. Humpty Dumpty went off the wall. We also have O for ox, a kind of animal, a big cow with horns. O is for old, your grandma and your grandpa are old. O is for octopus, an animal with eight tentacles. O is for the olives, you find olives on top of your pizza and in your salad. O is for the otter, an animal that swims in the ocean, in the water. And there's O for the ostrich. The ostrich is a very big bird. It cannot fly, but it runs very fast. Then we have O for the octagon, a shape with eight sides. How about this one? There are words that do not begin with O, but they have O sound in the middle. So we have O in box, you put a lot of things in the box. There's O in hot. When you feel hot, you want to turn on your fan, your air conditioner. And then we have O for the dog. O in dog. When there's a dog, maybe it will try to bark very loud. There's O in dog. There's also O in pot. And this kind of pot, you put the flowers in it. Then you have O in mop. You mop the floor clean. There's also O in fox, an animal that lives in the forest. There's O in frog, a green animal. There's also O in pond, the place or the home of the frogs. And there's also O in lock. How about some words again that has O sound but do not begin with O? There's also O in popcorn, a yummy snack. There's O in the dolphin, a friendly animal. There's also O in sock, you wear your sock in your feet. There's also O in hot dog, a yummy snack also. There's also O in blocks, maybe you have these ones in your toy box. There's also O in clock, you use the clock to tell time. There's also O in laptop. Some of you are using laptop for our class. And you have O in the rocket. The astronauts ride the rocket to the moon. Let's move on to sorting our words. So we have here our words for the sound hound. And we only need words that has the letter O beginning sound and O middle sound. Now, there are not a lot of words that end with O, so we will skip the end. Now, how about the old, the picture of old? O, the, old, the. O in old is in the beginning. Frog, fur, og, fur. Og, it's in the middle. Off, 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 it's in the middle also. Dolphin, the all fin, the all fin, it's in the middle. Off should go in the beginning. Sorry, it goes here. How about on? Ah, mm, ah, mm, it's in the beginning. Octagon, octagon, octagon. It's in the beginning. How about the rocket? Rocket. Rocket. It's in the middle. How about clock? Clock. Clock. It's in the middle. Next one. Octopus. 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 It's in the beginning. How about otter? Otter author in the beginning how about olive olives olives it's in the beginning also ostrich 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 in the beginning how about hot dog hot dog hot dog in the middle how about ox 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 in the beginning how about box B Ox, b, ox in the middle. How about dog? D, o, g, d, o, g in the middle. How about blocks? B, ox, b, ox in the middle also. And last one, sock, s, ox, s, ox in the middle. 
How about we move to the next part? Our sentence about Ollie. And Ollie sees a lot of things here. Let's do the sentence for Ollie. The first word that we have, Ollie sees the octopus. Maybe he went to the zoo and checked out the octopus in one of the aquariums. How about this one? Ollie sees the ostrich. Ollie sees the ostrich. It's for letter O ostrich. And maybe he went to the zoo again to check the big bird ostrich. Ollie sees the otter. He sees the otter swimming in the water. That's the otter. Next, Ollie sees the octagon. Octagon is a kind of shape with eight sides. Another one. Ollie sees the optometrist. And the optometrist, this is the doctor for your eyes. So we have here the optometrist. Another one. We have Ollie sees the olives. Remember, the olives are the ones that you see in your salads or maybe in your pizza topping. Ollie sees the ox. Ox, that's a kind of animal that is big and has horns. And the last one, Ollie sees the post office. Maybe he went there to visit his friend. The mailman works in a post office. Now, for the next part of our class, let's do our work time and let's do the word get. Please trace the word get, G, E, and letter T. That is the word get. G, E, and letter T, get. Write also the word get, G-E-T. Those are the letters in the word get. And how about you color the word get, G-E, and letter T. That's our word get. Now let's circle also the word get in the boxes. Let's find them all. G-E and letter T that makes the word get. And for our pictures, if you've already cut the pictures, let's paste them in the correct letter. So G is for the goat, E is for elephant, and T is for train, and we made the word get. Let's move to the next work, but if you're not yet done, pause this video, play it again once you're done. The next one, you will still do the word get, trace, G, E, and letter T, get. G, E, letter T, get. Write the word get, G, E, T, and then underline get. You have the word get and color the word get, G, E, T. G, E, and letter T. And you have to write the missing letters, G, E, and T. Next one, G, E and T, get. How about we read our sentence and you only need to underline your word, get. I will go home and get my bike. So where is the word get here? And this is the word get. Now, if you're done cutting your letters, build them to make the word get G, E and letter T, this is the word get. G-E-T, get. If you're not yet done with the work, it's okay. Pause this video. Play it again once you're done. Let's move to our booklet. So I have here our letter O booklet, capital O and lowercase o. Please trace. Trace your name also. The first page that we have here. Where is the octopus? Octagon. Color your octagon. And the octagon looks like this. It has eight sides. This is an octagon. Next one. Where is the octopus? This is our octopus, the animal that has eight tentacles. We have our octopus here. Next one. Where is the ostrich? This is an ostrich, a big bird that has very long neck and also long feet. It doesn't know how to fly, but it can run fast. 
How about the next page? Where is the otter? This is an otter. It knows how to swim in the water. So if you see this one, this is an otter. So we have our otter here. Another one, where is the ox? This is an ox, it's a kind of cow, and it has horns. So we have our ox. We're done already with our booklet. If you're not yet done with the work, it's okay. Pause this video, play it again once you're done. I'll be showing you the sound hound on the screen. We already did this one during our lesson. Now, I am going to count up to 10. And if you're not yet done uh, working on this work, please pause the video and you can check the pictures here that you need to paste. So I will start counting from 1 to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. I'll be moving to the next work, but I have already shown you where the pictures are for our sound hound. Now, can we move to the next page? And the next work, we will skip the work for the sentence about Ollie, and let's move on to this work, our work for building sentence. So let's read our sentence. Where is the ox? Octagon. So you need to read your sentence. Where is the octagon? Cut the words and build them together. Where is the octagon? And let's write where is, oops, let me fix this one, is the octagon. Try to make your letter small so that you can still fit your word. And remember, our sentence is a question. It ends with a question mark. It's asking you, where is the octagon? And remember to color your picture. My work on the screen might be different. I have a different picture, but we almost have the same work. Now, can we move to the next? If you're not yet done, pause this video, play it again once you're done. The next work that we're going to do is about the octopus. Let's read our sentence. Where is the octopus? And if you're done cutting, build your sentence. Where is the octopus? And please write, where is the octopus. So maybe you're looking for it in the ocean. You're asking, where is the octopus? And remember to color your picture. Let's move to the next work. If you're not yet done, pause this video. Play it again once you're done. The next page is our ostrich. Where is the ostrich? Let's build the sentence. Where? is the ostrich. Let's write where is the ostrich. And then please color also your ostrich. If you're not yet done with the work, it's okay. Pause this video, play it again once you're done. I'll be moving to the next work. Let's do this one first. Trace your letter O, both capital and lowercase letter O. Remember to go around and around like an orange. It will never stop. This is how you make your letter O. So always go at the top first at the top and go around. See, you have your letter O's there, both capital and lowercase letter O. And this one is our work for tracing and writing the letter O. Remember to follow leave spaces in between your letters. If you're not yet done, pause this video, play it again once you're done. I'll be moving on to the last work that we have on the screen, and that is about Ollie. 
please trace your sentence about Oli and we will spell the word and draw the picture inside the box. Now, for me, I'm showing you the work. That's why it doesn't look like the same on your worksheet. So we have number one, you have the word olives. O-L-I-V-E-S, olives. Please write olives. And when you draw, make an oval, two ovals. And then there's a circle at the top. That's the olives. I'll be moving to number two. Number two is the ox. So make your ox. O-N-X, ox. Draw a circle. Draw two eyes. One semicircle and then two dots for the nostrils. Add some horns. And then a body that's oval. Four legs and a tail. That's our ox. For number three, it is a long word. It is the octopus. O-C-T-O-P-U-S. Let's draw the octopus. Draw an oval. Draw two eyes and then a smiley face. And the arms of the octopus, it's eight of them. You call the arms of the octopus tentacles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's eight tentacles. And how about we move to number four word? It's the ostrich. O-S-T-R-I-C-H, ostrich. Please spell and write your ostrich. When you draw your ostrich, make an oval, add a triangle, make a long neck, add an oval, and then the tail and the wings, add legs that are long, and this is our ostrich. So you have olives, ox, octopus and ostrich. These are the words that you need to write and draw on your worksheet there. If you're not yet done with the work, pause this video, play it again once you're done. And I'll be moving on to the last part of our work. Please also do your letter O crown and let me give you your sticker, friend. So for today, Julius and Eliana, since we have recorded class, I'll be picking the friend for you. For Julius, I'll be putting you here in Tracker. And for Eliana, I'll be putting you here in Chase. Oops, what happened? Let me fix it. There you go. Now you have your sticker friends for today. And I hope that you finish your work also. And I will see you tomorrow on our next class. Bye-bye.